you. Hi, and welcome back to another episode of MacLeanTalk.se videos here on YouTube. Today I'm going to talk a bit about uh, noise reduction and how to remove unwanted noise from your trains. As many people asked, I'm using a type of felt under the tracks and I'm going to show you why. Most people build their uh, model railroad either on a flat table or on a wooden structure and then you make the track bed out of plywood. Both these approaches has the disadvantage that it's amplifying the noise coming from the, the train passing on the steel tracks, metal to metal. There are several ways to reduce the noise. One of them is to reduce the transferred amount of noise from the rail down into the wooden plate. The other way is to re reduce the area of the vibrating plate. So instead of having a complete tabletop, we have only wood under the, the rail. We can also, of course, absorb sound as it comes out in the air by adding uh, uh, sound absorbing felts inside tunnels and such things or beneath the, the wooden plate. I've tested the basically three materials. I've tested the traditional cork, which is available in any shop. Uh, I've tested the also rubber underlay. And my felt. And uh, felt is uh, an IKEA product. It's really an anti-slip mat to use under normal carpets so the carpets won't uh, slip and it has a kind of a high friction rubber cover on both sides of the felt so the the the, the, the m rail uh, does not come apart and it does not move and you don't have to screw it it stands firmly where you place it and that's one thing i like I made some measurements on the sound pressure and as you can see, to the right with the felt it's one third compared without. One other advantage is that the sound gets a more comfortable tone, not so high pitched. The material is quite easy to uh, work with. I cut it with a scissor. I then position it on the board and uh, put spots of glue like this underneath. Uh, press gently with the finger so the, the felt kind of suck in, soak in the, the glue and then I fix it with the needles like this and lastly I put the rails on while the glue is still wet once the glue is dry I can remove the needles and there it is I hope you have good use of the information about noise reduction. Thank you for watching and do not forget to subscribe on Merklin of Sweden channel here on YouTube. Bye bye.